Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to another episode of the Forgotten Weapons Library. I'm Ian. Of course, this week on Forgotten Weapons, we've been taking a look at some really interesting and weird Swiss firearms, and I figured we should take a look at a book dealing with interesting and weird Swiss firearms. So we have this guy, and I apologize in advance, I'm going to butcher the title, uh, Bewaffnung und Ausrüstung der Schweizer Armee, from 1817. This is um, Waffen. Drei. Uh, this is a book on machine guns, submachine guns, and mortars that were used by the Swiss military, or experimented with by the Swiss military, uh, from 1817 on up to fairly modern days. It's got pictures of some really interesting and amazing guns that you probably won't find very many other places. In fact, let's uh, take a look inside it here for a minute. All right, if we just start at the beginning here, we've got a number of really interesting Swiss maxims, including this one. It's got a uh, rather unusual optical sight mounted on it. Moving along, let's see what else do we have in here. That's a little bit unusual. And then we have a whole progression of machine guns that do not show up very often. Ooh, here I know. One more page. Now there is something funky. Um, not sure where that is, um, but it appears to be a hand crank operated manual machine gun. Pretty cool. Real light, uh, light frame, unlike most guns of that era. There's something kind of nifty, huh? So, really cool, as you can see, a lot of really neat stuff in there. And this is, in fact, one of a whole series of books very much like this. Unfortunately, this is a bit of a trick book review. I can't actually tell you where to get this. I was, in fact, hoping that maybe one of you guys could tell me where I can get the others. And while we're at it, we can tell everyone where they can get this one as well. Um, these were published in either Germany or Switzerland. We haven't been able to find them at all here in the States. Uh, this one we found while we were overseas. So if you happen to know where we can pick up some more of the, uh, the other books in this series, covering things like pistols, bolt-action rifles, um, have one on revolvers, uh, please let us know in the comments, and uh, we'll spread that around and see if we can't get our hands on some other copies and see some other really neat guns. So thanks for watching, and uh, good luck trying to find this.